Bye, Michelson Shed. Here we come, Ensenada. Yeah. All right, Cowgen. Look at us in our matching vest, blue shirts, looking all cute. All right, guys, we're heading to Ensenada today on a beautiful Michelson 43. What hole number is this one? 90. 90? No. 80. 89? 9. Anyways, we're heading down to Ensenada from San Diego on this beautiful, this is a 2019 43, I think. Yeah. So this one's going down, uh, doing offshore delivery. So it's got to stay a year down at, in Ensenada, Hotel Corral. And it's very exciting. Tomorrow we are picking up a brand new Michelson 43 and a brand new Michelson 57 off of the freighter down in Ensenada. We got me, Captain Pablo. We got brother PJ up there on the bow, can you see him? And we got little brother Trey with us too. So we wanted to make a video, show you guys what the offload looks like. So here it is. All right, brothers, we're just leaving the basin. Valley high in the background. Trey got the memo to wear the, uh, the blue shirt with the vest, PJ did not. I know you guys, do. You guys excited to go to Ensenada? Very excited. Super excited. Awesome. It's gonna be a victory at sea, but there's no other boat I'd rather be on. Yeah, true that. All right, guys, we'll get some more more footage for you to come. What do you think? It's not too bumpy out here. No, not at all. Of course, we're just leaving the mouth. The entrance. Give me a smile. Ensenada yeah, it's an auto bound. Weather was supposed to be crazy and it's just all time right now. It's gorgeous out. Toto Santos over here. Santos, Absolutely gorgeous trip down south. Hopefully tomorrow the weather is just as good. We're gonna try and do some uh, cool other stuff, like maybe go to a couple of restaurants in Ensenada. Yeah, yeah, we're gonna check it out. We don't know what, what it's gonna be like with COVID, but we're gonna. Uh, get our work done. Awesome. All right, where are we, guys? Welcome to Ensenada. 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 Look at that. Coming up What's to the Only yeah, took us 20 25 20 minutes, minutes, baby. <laughs> Sweet. We made it to the corral. All right, so where are we going to be offloading the boats tomorrow, isn't it? Right over there, Sam. See the ship? Uh, with the little red cranes? Nope. Our, our ship is, <laughs> <Just> <laughs> Our ship is going to be pulling right in there. Right on over there. Pretty cool, guys. So we brought this boat down. Who do we call for? It's going to live here. Everybody just like... VHF. Michael Sinyans, baby. Beautiful hotel corral and marina. Baja, California, and Sonata. Look at our gorgeous captain up there. Ah! PJ so awesome. All right, guys, well, we made it. It only took us about three hours. I think it's like 65 miles to get down here or something. But pretty cool. We're waiting on getting a slip now. We're going to stay the night in the beautiful uh, hotel over there, pick our boats up. But this is something that you guys can be doing on your Michelson. You can bring it down here. There's really cool wine tasting about, uh, I don't know, 15 minute car ride away from here. And downtown Ensenada is only about a five minute drive. All really cool stuff to do down here. Cool things to do. All right, guys, Michaels and viewers, we're on YouTube now, Paul. You can't be talking smack on PJ anymore. <laughs> we made it down to Ensenada, beautiful hotel corral, the four of us. Bienvenido. What are we doing now? We're going back to the boat. We're going to organize all of our uh, stuff for the launch tomorrow. Okay. Picking up a Gen 2 57 and a Gen 2 Michelson 43. 
Pretty cool. We got the hotel behind us. The hotel is so cool for all of the people watching this video right now. Like, huh, I wonder what it's like bringing my boat down to Ensenada. Worthy. So easy too. Oh, Trey, come get in this. If I knew if I knew how to turn this, Trey, I just turned the phone around, dude. The Talk newest Michelson employee. Trey, Trey you is our, the newest Michelson employee. It's pretty cool. So when you get a job at Michelson Yachts, they start you off at a living wage of zero dollars a year. So. <laughs> But you get a green t-shirt and a vest. Like poor PJ. I didn't even get a green t-shirt or a vest. So. All I got was this stupid COVID mask. Yeah, seriously. So when people are like, how do you keep the prices of your boat so low? Just remember, it's because they don't pay their employees. We uh, we barely get clothed by them. No, I'm just kidding. But it's so cool. How do I turn the freaking camera? All right, so there's a Michelson 43 right there. There's a Michelson Nomad over there. Oh, there's another Michelson 43 right there too. Yeah. How many boats do we have down here now? A hell of a lot. There's another 43 up here on the dock. What? Do you know the story behind this one? This one is the one that doesn't have the windows in the front of it, which looks like a one of one to me. Yeah, that's probably the only one we've ever done that on. Uh, I no. love those forward windows, but it must be very structurally strong, I would say. Yeah. Oh, it's show them the, uh, the old 60. Oh, boat. that is a cool boat. Old 60 right there. Got our classic lines. Was that one of Fred Simon's boat? Look at us, matching vests, matching shirts, looking good. Oh, this good. is terrible. At least I have, oh. I have a nomad on the back of my shirt. Yeah. Attaboy, PJ. Ensenada offloads, guys. Getting better and better every time. So we're down here, we made it to Ensenada finally. It's five o'clock in the afternoon, slash five o'clock somewhere. But look how gorgeous the corral is, you guys. So look, you can keep your boat right there. When your friends wanna come down, you put them up in any of these beautiful hotel rooms. How long was that ride? Three, maybe four hours? It was easy. It was three, butter. Three point five hours exactly. Weather not even Perfect. that great, and it was a fantastic ride. Trey, ride. you're our newest YouTube star, dude. You're the face of Michaels and Yachts. You're definitely the youngest and best looking. So, PJ, we're starting to get the comments like, "Dude, your dad's <laughs> looking old these days." I like, go, oh, "That's my older brother." Paul's always looking good. But look at this gorgeous pool that you can't swim in because of COVID. They'll open it soon, I'm sure. Hey, and I'm so excited. Where are we going tonight, boys? The Barria. 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 Yeah, yeah. Good. All right, guys. We uh, we made it in the restaurant like an hour ago. I forgot to videotape the outside, but we made it here. What's Barria. it called? Guadalajara Bar. What's it called? La Guadalajara Barria. Oh, yeah. So Barria. good. All right, so we got Barria. Barria. You can get giant beers. But it's absolutely delicious. What do you guys think? 10 out of 10? 11 out of 10. Yeah, this place is good. Look at, show them the taco you're making. 11 out of 10. Look at this. Yeah. This right here is called. This ghost, is some good. Ghost pepper? Pizza. That's too much ghost pepper. I'm doing double. Dude, what are you doing? All right, Michelson viewers, we're back. We're sitting in the back of Tavo's truck right now. Trying to get through the line at the, not the port captain, but the actual port. The actual port. The not, ship is in there. Not having great luck so far. We got somebody that's hopefully gonna be able to help us here in a sec. We're all vested up. Went and bought these really nice orange vests because we thought we were gonna need them and turns out we probably don't. On the plus side, it's pissing down rain and we neglected to bring any rain gear. So <laughs> that's, that's uh, always fun. It's, it's all back at the hotel. Uh, yeah. We brought crazy rain gear. We showed up wearing t-shirts and our cool new Michelson vests. In our optimistic uh, approach to life, we figured we wouldn't need it because the sun was going to come out. <laughs> and we were completely wrong. So this will be fun. All right, guys. Updates to follow. Stay tuned. Here goes the second gate. I think it was our vest that got us through. I think it definitely was the vest. This orange is just lolled the orange, over the, the orange on top of the, this one's just got mirrored windows. They're probably filming me, filming them. Send Some slight break in the rain. Yeah, just send it, Tavo. Buenos <laughs> <laughs> Paul's all pissed off over there. <laughs> a lot of high security checks here. Seriously, some cool mirrored windows. What was fun was when you walk through the metal detector and it goes off, nobody says anything. <laughs> <laughs> just let you keep going. Feel good? Yeah. Gracias. Gracias. 
Not cool. Cool, cool. There's the new 43. It's Trey with our boxes. 57's over there. One more video for those of you that don't know what a uh, mold looks like, what your boat is built in. How cool, just a giant mold for some big. Look, it even has like a bulbous built in. Really cool. All right, going back over. Drop to our death. Where they at? All right, here's our guys right here. Getting the propellers out right now. Coming in these big boxes. Wow, that gas smells crazy. It's not gas, it's steel burning. Or whatever that is, it smells crazy. Got it off. Yeah. Turn both ignitions on. What? Turn both ignitions on. Turning ignitions on. Look how cool this is. So our hotel that we stayed at is over there. Are we going to videotape putting the propellers on? Yeah, I can do that. All right, so explain what we've done so far. We have... Uh Paired the shafts, taken the propellers out of their crates, got everything ready to slide the props up on the shaft. Paul had to find the ignition switches. We had to get control. What do you think, Tava? You loving it? I like it. Loving every minute of it. It's starting to rain on us again. Yeah. When you're pulling away from the ship, look at your rudders. Wow. Good luck, dude. Gotta get the video. PJ, come be video guy. Passing the torch. Okay. So they're gonna put on those. They're gonna put on those propellers. And the boat's just hanging in midair. Okay, you could be helping. Yeah. All right, Kelly. Get the wood, let's go, let's go. I need a bit of wood. The wood? Yeah, it's in the Yeah. It's uh, probably 500 feet. All right, Nick, this one's for you in the pouring down rain. We're wearing t-shirts. <laughs> what do you think, Trey? Going through the boat. It's all raining, soaking wet. Hey, don't drop it. <laughs> Hola. Good looking boat right there. And falling. It's nice, at least we're not getting rained on in here. Alright, I way you go. Yeah, don't, no rush, Trey, we got time. Woohoo! So much. <laughs> All right. Yeah, Trey, we made it. 
We made it, boys. Look at that. How crazy that thing is. Woo! That was wild. That was a crazy experience. That was crazy, huh? All right, so now they just got to get the 57 off, but we're heading over to the fuel dock at Hotel Corral, guys. Successful 43 delivery so far. And this boat is just sweet. Look at this, all the electronics, my compass. <laughs> just kidding, who needs it? It's raining, we're having a great time. Oh, they all just went down. Oh no, that one guy's still chilling there. Here's our weekend recap. We uh, were supposed to take the boats back this afternoon. Port captain closed the ocean down due to bad weather. Won't give us our exit paperwork. Coronavirus. Coronavirus. So we're gonna keep the boats here in Ensenada for a couple days, come back on Wednesday and retrieve them. Do our exit paperwork and head to San Diego. Shout out to PJ for just having the most level head about the entire thing. That, but, Shout out to Paul for being slightly crazy like myself. <laughs> I'm, just, All right. I'm just here for the ride. What do you think, Tavo? Oh, this, this guy screwed us over. <laughs> All right, YouTube. We're signing off. We'll be back. We'll make another video on Wednesday. Borderline. Oh, uh, yeah. Maybe we'll add some stuff in the borderline. We're going to buy a puppy. What a nightmare. Don't yeah. ship your boat to Ensenada, ladies and gentlemen. Comment what kind of dog you want us to buy on the borderline. Uh, All right, and we're out.